Chevron's captain, Sikanda Raza, underlined his status as a world-class T20 cricketer after clinching the Most Valuable Player of the Tournament award in the International League T20, which ended in the United Arab Emirates on Saturday. Raza finished the tournament with 313 runs and 13 wickets. He also scooped three player of the match awards. However, his Dubai Capitals were losing finalists, going down by 45 runs to MI Emirates in the finals of the tournament. Raza has since made his way to Pakistan, where he will feature for Lahore Qalanders and the Pakistan Super League. Moving on, Mountaineers won a fifth Logan Cup title after beating Eagles by an innings and 123 runs inside three days at Old Ararians. The win and bonus points took the Mountaineers to the top of the table ahead of the Southern Rocks after the final round of games. Rising stars Brian Bennett and Tony Munyonga set the foundation for the Mountaineers win with double centuries before veteran Tendai Chatara led the way in bowling out Eagles on the follow-on. Mountaineers are now joined with Tuskers for most Logan Cups with five. Pitbulls continue their dominance and the Paramount Garments under 20 Rugby League with an exciting win over older Georgians. We get more in the following report. Pitbulls made it five wins in five in the Paramount Garments Under-20 Rugby League, cementing their favourite stake with a 33-25 win over all Georgians in the biggest game of the season so far. Both teams had come into the match with a 100% record, but Pitbulls' renowned tenacity was on full display as they mowed the Dragons in their own backyard. In other matches, a response club brought themselves back into contention for the playoffs, coming from behind to beat bitter rivals Old Ararians 32-26 in a thrilling derby game. Sportivo had lost back-to-back -back games coming into the clash with OH, but they showed character to upset their more offensive opponents. I mean, this is what we needed to, to stay in uh, so that we managed to also try and have a chance to get to the finals. So next week, I mean, it's uh, all guns basically coming out and I'm, I'm kind of 100% with this victory. The boys can, uh, are confident enough to, to get over the line next week. Let's focus on the next game. We won this one. Dust and done. We're going to the next people's and we're coming, we're going for a war, not going to lie. We just have to be confident in ourselves, execute. We have the talent, the moves, you name it. We just have to be confident in ourselves. Thank you. The Paramount Garments Under-20 Rugby League has become a staple on the rugby provincial calendar, playing a pivotal role in laying the foundation for the success of the Junior Sables, who have gone on to clinch back-to-back -back African titles. Tournament, why? Because we are bridging schoolboy rugby and club rugby. There has always been a gap of continuance when um, the boys and the girls play rugby in high school and when they play in, um, in clubs. So we are bridging that gap and we are very proud of it. This is the key of the development of rugby in Zimbabwe. As you might know, uh, the under 20 has been performing very well. They are the two-time champions in the Bathurst Trophy and uh, we are also hosting the Bathurst Trophies later this year. So it's very important that we grow this talent so that we also create um, a pool for the under 20 that is also going to fit into the future pool for the country. The league has also been a hit with supporters who have turned out in their numbers, citing the quality of the rugby on display as a major draw card. Enjoy watching them because they're young, still young, and they still got the energy and the talent is still there. I don't know after the under 20s what they do after when they're done with the under 20s, but I really support them because the talent is there. We always come to every game we see because they are inspired with the under 20 boys. We coached these kids from ECD to Greater. <laughs> With teams like Marondra Talons, Zambezi Steelers and Zimbiru joining the under-20 rugby bandwagon, the game is set for continued growth, something that will widen the player base and give fans more reasons to smile. Konapo Konapo, Ipapo Ipapo Pazetien Prime, DSTV Channel 294, the place to be.